I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with in a while so this will probably end up being like combined with uh, tomorrow's video <laughs> um but I was watching Big Bang while I'm getting ready to head out so we're at our resort we're staying out we have our little own like studio suite and I thought we were supposed to have a king one but we end up having I don't, know if, I don't even think there's a queen. I think these are two full beds which is like whatever like I really don't care. I just thought I'd booked a king suite or a king bed suite. Um, did I even catch up with you guys at the airport this morning? I don't even know. This is probably going to be the most interesting video because I don't remember what I've done and what I've not done. And I'm sitting backwards in bed because the only place to put you guys while I do this is like right here. Um, so we got here. We had some pizza. Well, I say we. I said when he had any. Um, and he's sitting. He's laying right there. Um, I had some pizza for lunch, um, and then, um, uh, I'm trying to think of, what was I saying? Oh, then we came back, um, and we both were really tired because we had gotten up at 4.30 to get to the airport on time, and while Winnie slept on the flight, I got maybe 20 minutes on the entire, like, two hour flight, so I was very tired. So, um, I wanted to take a nap too, so we got back here after we went and got pizza, which is at our resort. It's like, so it's a villas, and then there's like multiple other things here, like there's a water park on property, there's regular pools that go with the vacation rentals, there's people who actually like own some of the apartments and stuff here, it's really interesting. Um, it's really cool, like I've never seen such a resort like this. Unfortunately, it's not an all-inclusive. You do have to pay for each like, If I want to go to the water park, I'd have to pay a separate fee and all that kind of stuff, which kind of sucks. But you know, what are you gonna do, right? Um, I just messed this up. <laughs> I think I accidentally let go and then kind of I didn't do it right. So anyhow, we took a nap earlier. Then my watch is going off. Have you heard that? Just did a big ding. Um, my hair's kind of wet, so that's what's making this more difficult. I, um, after we took a nap, I went to the pool for a little bit. I left him in here, but um, because there was no shade at the pool deck, and so I didn't want him to have to just like lay on the hot concrete in the sun the whole time, you know. So. We um, took our nap, I went to the pool, and then I came back and I showered, and ow, my neck just popped for you guys. I'm getting text messages, that's what, I'll deal with that in a minute. Um, and then 
we watched a little TV together. I went to the pool. I, sh I just got out of the shower, got dressed again, and we're gonna take the rental car, which I will try to, okay, I think you gotta watch me, dude. I don't know if y'all heard that, but they just like, honk, 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 honk. Like, I think it's locked plenty well, Winnie. Hey, shh, shh, Winnie. They woke him up and it startled him. You're okay, baby. Um, but anyhow, um, I'll show you the rental car when we get out there. They gave me a Nissan Rogue, but when I first got in it, I looked at it and went, how am I supposed to drive this? This is the most confusing looking thing ever. Anyone who drives a Nissan Rogue, power to you. Because I thought Dodge's like dial to turn from like my gear shift was something to get used to. <laughs> it is nothing like the way a Nissan Rogue is. And I don't know if it's all Nissans. I've never personally driven a Nissan. So this has been an interesting experience. Sorry, I'm turning my head really far. It's the easiest way to not have to basically strain my shoulders really bad to get this braid put in um, my hair. Cause I didn't want to deal with putting it up in a messy bun while it's wet. And I didn't want to deal with something like, I'm just going to braid it. Um, so anyhow, I'm getting ready to finish getting ready. I'm getting ready to finish getting ready. Basically what I mean is I'm going to finish up getting ready with everything I need to do besides my hair when I'm done here. Um, like once I'm done with my hair. Not a lot. I gotta put more deodorant. Obviously I showered so I washed off any old deodorant I had on from earlier. Um, so I'm gonna wash. I'm gonna, I mean I'm gonna wash. You know my brain. Um, it's kind of fried right now. So anyhow, I'm going to um, put on deodorant. Um, I don't even think I need my sunglasses. It's almost eight o'clock. So, oh, can you that? is it? Quite it's 7.36. I don't know if you heard that. If not, it's 7.30. Um, it's not as late as I thought it was. I thought it was like at least 7.45, 7.50, but it's only 7.35. Um, but we're gonna go down to Disney Springs. We're about 10 miles out from Disney Springs. However, I don't know what traffic's gonna be like on I-4. Anyone who knows anything about Florida, the resort area, like when I say resort, I guess I should say resort parks, like as in Universal, SeaWorld, um, Disney World, anyone knows anything knows I-4. Like I'm gonna guess, even though it's a Thursday night and it's after seven, I'm gonna guess I-4 is still gonna be pretty busy. It usually is. So I'm um, 10 miles out. I don't know what kind of um, traffic I'm gonna run into. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna head down to Disney Springs. Ooh. Sorry, I'm trying to unzip this better so I can get to my other stuff like my deodorant. Is my deodorant in there? No, yes, okay, it's in this bag. Um, so I'm gonna put on <gasps> something leaked. Something leaked, this is all wet. Look guys, something leaked. And I have a feeling it was either my toner. Or my, okay there's my toner. It doesn't look like it leaked. So I think it might have been this. Yes, there's more in there. I believe that's what it was. My Meissler water. I bought little travel things but my slur water and toner in there so that I didn't have to deal with carrying the big things and apparently I did not get the although I think the toner may have leaked a little bit too must have not have gotten the lids on tight that sucks as long as the cotton pads aren't already no they're not already wet it'll be okay this is all this is all soft. We're okay. The worst part is some of the stuff turned blue from where my new toothbrush holder wrapper got all nasty. But it's okay. It's okay. It is totally okay. We are not going to freak out over this. <laughs> it has been a trip already, guys. Oh. 
I bought some new products before we came. Like, this is a whole new deodorant. I bought this is like a whole new toothpaste thing. This holder's new. These bottles are like because I wasn't sure I was gonna have enough stuff otherwise. I guess I've been using it, but I'm gonna put some deodorant on. Um, I don't think I'm gonna need sunscreen because the sun's about to like start setting. That kind of hurt. Yep, I have a pimple or underground hair again or something. Anyhow, um, I'm gonna grab a jacket just in case wherever we go is cold. Um, there we go. Um, <laughs> what are you doing? Did you see something? There's a plant right outside our room and it keeps blowing in the wind and it keeps grabbing its interest. Okay, here's my jacket. My shoes are over there. Like I said, we're gonna head to Disney Springs. I'm gonna find myself a couple things. Well, this resort is nice. I don't like the shampoo and conditioner I just used with the body wash and all that. And so, I know I like Disney's products. So, so since we're going to Disney Springs, I'm gonna try to find that. I might try to find a new jacket or a new pair of shorts just because I can. I don't need them. Just because I can't, where's my phone? Oh, it's right here. And the car key. Oh boy, okay. But yeah, so uh, we're about to head out and we're just gonna do a little bit of shopping and get some dinner out at Disney Springs. Um, where's your best, Winnie? And I'm gonna take you all along with us, of course. Is it in here, babe? Oh, it's in the front, isn't it? And, um, I really don't know where we're going in Disney Springs. Like, which shops we're going to go into. I, I really don't know. I really don't know what all we're going to get into. I just know we're going to Disney Springs. And that's that for now. So, stay tuned. And I'll keep you updated. We'll see y'all when we get there. <laughs> okay, I don't know if you guys can hear me, but we are at the restaurant called T-Rex in Disney Springs. As you can see here. Look how cool this place is. It reminds me of Rainforest Cafe, but it's like dinosaur instead of like a rainforest. I went to start filming when he started scratching really loud. Okay, anyhow, what's up, guys? We are back in the room from Disney Springs. Uh, when he just finished eating, I wanted to show you all what all I got. Um, we went to M&M's World, which just opened recently, I'm pretty sure, in Disney Springs. We went to Coke World, and then obviously we ate at T-Rex. And I wanted to, I was gonna vlog in Coke World and in Eminem's world, but then like because it was getting closer to closing time and I wanted to get some souvenirs and stuff because I don't know if I'll be back in Disney Springs. Um, I would like to be, but I don't I don't know if I will be. Um before we have to leave again until you know next time. But because of that, I decided not to vlog, but I wanted to show you guys my haul of things I got. So first of all, they're having a sale on some of these cool looking cups at the T-Rex restaurant we went to. So you can see it says T-Rex right there has a little dinosaur on it. The little mascot's like a purple dinosaur, which I think is so cute. And it's just, it looks like one of those things you'd get at the fair. But it was on sale, it was really cheap. So I thought, why not? Um, they finally had my name on something, if I can get it out of the bag. So one side is like the actual T-Rex. Is it gonna focus? <gasps> Hold on, let me put you back up here. I had to go earlier. That way I can use both hands there. Well, maybe it'll focus. Doesn't really wanna. 
be in focus. Anyhow, it's a T-Rex and it has my name and on the other side it says like where it's from. Um, also, if you hear the extra noise, I have the windows open. <laughs> like, this is just the screen. We don't have the air conditioning on. We just have the fan and the windows open to keep us cooler. And also, Winnie's looking out right now. If you see the little gap here, I'll show you. There's Winnie. He's looking out. Um, anyhow, then we went to Coke World. I love Coke. I am obsessed with Coke. I'm always drinking it, she says, even though she has a Dr. Pepper next to her. But that was all I could find. They were out of Coke. Like at the place I went to get that, I went to like another, um, because everything was closing. And I decided I wanted a drink. So I went like to a Walgreens right off property. And all they had was Dr. Pepper or Pepsi. They were out of Coke. So I got a Dr. Pepper. Um, so at Coke World, they had air fresheners that make your car smell like Coke. They also had cherry Coke, but I just got the original scent. But like, <laughs> my car is gonna smell like coke. My truck's gonna smell like coke when I get back. <laughs> I this was like two dollars at the checkout counter, so I was like, okay, why not? Um, another thing that they got me on at the checkout counter, I used to have a whole set of these as a kid, and I loved them. I had the cherry coke, the vanilla coke, the regular coke, like this one, and it was like two dollars at the checkout counter, and I was like, I gotta do it. I had one of those as a kid, and I loved it. Um, and then. We got Winnie a magnet to add to his magnet collection. Why does this not want to focus tonight? My goodness. There we go. So yeah, it says, as you can see, Coca-Cola, Walt Disney World Resort. Um, Cause I like things that say where they're from, you know? Whoa, what if my camera spell fell? And then I also got something for myself. I got this Tervis that has like little mickeys and cokes all over it and it says um the coca-cola company and disney walt disney world resort so i thought that was really cute and it like has one of those tops that pops open it's hard to do i know it'll get easier and it's just but it's also like a no spill kind and i found this and i didn't want just anything coke because the main thing is, as much as I love Coke, there's also like Coke World in like Vegas. There's one in, you know, like, I think there's one in Vegas now. There's one in New York City and stuff. So I didn't want one of those. I wanted one that said where it's from, you know? Um, and then in m ms World, they didn't have as much labeled like they did at Coke World. Same with T-Rex. So all we got was some m I got some M&Ms that I can eat, but it comes in this little Mickey thing. But it has the Eminem logo and it says Disney Springs. So I can remember where I got it. And who knows, this may turn into like cotton balls on this side, little cotton swabs on this side, and bobby pins in the middle or something. Like, like this could turn into all kinds of things when I'm done with it. But the main reason I was willing to get this was because I can have an Eminem snack tomorrow. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's all we got at Eminem's World, so. Um. Yeah, that's what we did at Disney Springs tonight. We are back at the resort now. It is 12.20 a.m. technically speaking. And we have tours tomorrow to go look at houses. I don't know if I've talked about that on the vlog, but um, I've got offered my dream job here in Central Florida. Um, I don't want to live in Orlando and they said I didn't have to. I could live like, you know, in one of the suburbs. So I'm looking at some of them and I have a house, um, tours in a housing development tomorrow, um, to try to, you know, find a house or whatever. So, um, that was the main part of this trip that why we're in this resort and not in a Disney one because Disney is next week. The end of this week was Winnie and I house hunting. Um, so I can hopefully move for the next month or two. So I will take you guys along on that. Um, so we'll be house hunting tomorrow. And we have our um, first thing at 10. So I don't know where my phone is, but I'm gonna plug in the address of the like housing development in two ways. So I know what time I need to leave in the morning and everything. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get off of here. Luckily I already showered earlier before we went. And then obviously like all I did was like go in a couple little stores and everything. So I don't feel like getting to shower again. Um, Cause I showered after I went swimming um so i could specifically so i could wash my hair get the chlorine out but um oh i see my phone now <laughs> um but yeah so i'm going to get off of here i'm going to take my medicine take out my contacts brush my teeth because i feel like i have little sweaters as my mom calls it i can feel like my teeth are dirty 
Oh, a car went past. Winnie and I both heard something. There's a puddle out there. I think that's what we heard. Was it hitting the puddle? Um, no, it didn't rain. They watered the plants <laughs> and some of the water ran into the parking lot. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to get off of here. I'm going to brush my teeth, take my medicine. Not in that order because that would be weird. <laughs> um, take out my contacts. Like I said, no specific order. All of this. Um, I got Winnie's gear off him, I'm gonna take his collar off of him. Um, and then, yeah, we will, I'll turn off the light <laughs> that I only had on so you guys could see what I'm showing you. And then yeah, I'm gonna go to bed because, sorry, I heard something. Uh, and then I'm gonna go to bed so we can be up in the morning we gotta be up right, puppies. Oh. I was petting him, <laughs> that's why he was looking at me weird. But, all right, Winnie, you wanna help me close the vlog? Say, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell to be notified when we post our new videos, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.